Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name is Monica, and today we're doing my second update for my 9pan19. This is my year-long project pan where I'm trying to completely pan nine pans of product. If you missed my intro, I'll go ahead and throw that up in the cards if you kind of want to see, you know, the beginnings of this project, because this is going to be just kind of fairly quick, straightforward update on where I am right now. So let's go ahead and jump into the first product. I'm going to go with one that I haven't made too much products, products progress on and then we'll go into the one where I've had like a lot of progress. So the product I'm talk about first is my ABH Blush Trio in Peachy Love and uh, it's taken a while to pan a blush. It's surprising no one. These are what my pans are looking like currently. There are some like jabs here. That was me. I was trying to depot this because I thought it would be easier to use it up if I could focus on one of the three pans at a time, but it's unfortunately, I don't think I can get this out of the packaging without completely ruining the packaging. And I don't want to do this. I was hoping I could do the same thing I did with the Kat Von D palette and just like pop them out. I don't think it's that easy. But as you can see, there aren't really any major dips in the products yet. So being two months into this, I'm not gonna lie, I am getting a bit nervous about how long it's actually gonna take me to pan this, but I feel like I need to start multitasking with these shades. I can't just be using them as blush if I'm going to pan this, and I'm just now realizing that. So I'm gonna start trying to use these maybe as eyeshadow, start trying to use them in other more creative ways, because the, the way that I'm going, I really don't think I can hit pan, much less pan this by the end of the year if I'm just using it as a blush. It's just really making me realize like how far a blush can go, which is nuts. So those were three of my nine pans. The other pans, of course, come from my Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour Palette. And here, I actually made a lot of progress. So these are where my pans are at now. As you can see, I hit pan in the shade I've been using as my bronzer shade practically every day. And here, I was hoping to use this completely up by this update, but I have like just that much amount of product left on the bottom. I've also made some progress in the shade I'm using as my contour, but this one is gonna take a while for me to use up as well. So I'm actually really glad I was able to make this much progress on the contour palette. It's definitely making me feel a bit better about the product as a whole, considering I'm not making as much progress, like visible progress, on the blush. I did hit pan on the shade I'm using as my bronzer. I'm trying to make a goal for myself to use this up completely by mid-year, so by month six. That way I can start working on this shade because this shade is also usable for me as a bronzer. These two I can use as bronzers. This one I can only use as a contour. So I'm trying to use this one up by halfway so I can start working on this one. And hopefully I can also use that one up by the end of the project. I really don't think I'm going to have any issue using these lighter shades up. The yellow one might be a little bit different, but I figured I could still use that to set my eye primer. It might just look a little bit different, but I could still use it that way, uh, the same way I've been using the other light shades. I can 100% have this done by the next update, and I really hope I have a good dip in this one by my next check-in. Overall, I would say I think I'm at a pretty good place with this palette at this point, considering it's really only March, I have to think. Like, only March with this, I've got plenty of time, I'm making good progress. Only March with this, I'm feeling a little bit nervous. <laughs> but if you have any suggestions on any other ways to use blushes, if you've ever panned a blush, I haven't seen too many blush focused project pans. I mean, I've seen people mention panning a blush, but like they have pan on the blush already. Like, I think I'm probably just a newbie at this and I'm not that great at it yet. But if you've got any suggestions or if you know anyone who successfully panned a blush and has like any tip videos, please leave them in the comments below.
so that's everything for this quick update. If you guys are interested in the eye look I'm wearing today, it's a bit dramatic. I actually filmed it. I'm doing a palette resurrection that should hopefully be coming up within the next week using a palette I haven't reached for in a bit, and I'm actually pretty happy with how this look turned out. So make sure to keep an eye out for that video if you are interested. The lip color I'm wearing is just the Fenty lipstick in the shade Unbutton. This is like my go-to nude now. <laughs> if I need something quick, just throw it on throw it on. Thank you guys so much for watching and I cannot wait to see you in my next video. Bye.